Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Hot Wheels Dreams. We just got back from the Kmart day. Today is February 12th, 2011. We're going to go through all the pieces that we found. Uh, we found some really good variations. We got ourselves a treasure hunt and um, we had a great time. So stick around and we'll show you what we found. We'll be right back. All right, here we go. This is the Ford Mustang GT concept. Now this uh, is in a, uh, looks like a fire department. Yeah, it is a fire department uh, tampo. This is one of the ones we got today at, uh, at the Kmart day. Here is a 63 Corvette split window, yellow. Really cool tampo. It's got uh, the stinger stripe on it. Uh, really really cool piece chrome base and it's got uh, blacked out PR5's on it the Mustang had chrome chrome PR5's with a uh, looks like a charcoal plastic base nice piece Next is another Mustang, the uh, 2010 Ford Mustang GT. They did a lot of Mustangs this year. This is black with uh, pearl blue stripes. It's got the uh, tan interior. It looks like maybe a, a flesh, like, like a Barbie color interior. No tampos on the back and a black plastic base with uh, with gold uh, faster than ever wheels oh it is faster than ever there you go here's the try and stop me in uh, white I think it's a pretty cool piece I've seen a couple of these on the street um, I really forgot what they call them I think it's the uh, the spider, something like that. That's pretty cool. And of course the pass and gasser. Now if you lo look at these tampos, the yellow in here is a dull uh, satin finish. We did see one with a bright yellow satin finish uh, at, at the Kmart event. That was the only one, so I don't know if you guys have any out there. Uh, take a look. Uh, this has got the gray plastic base on it also. Uh, five spoke in the back and uh, skinny up front with a, uh, a gray engine uh, and uh, fuel injection. Chrome interior. Uh, sometimes these come through with a chrome engine and injection so keep an eye out for those. This one was pretty scarce. There was only a couple of the, uh, the Morris Minis at our event. I don't know about anybody else's. Uh, that's a cool little piece. Um, it's got kind of a light red tampo on the top and of course a metal base with uh, ten spoke red chrome ten spokes on it so uh, gray plastic interior custom 53 Chevy Really nice candy up red with yellow flames, clear hood, chrome engine, five spokes, and uh, gray plastic base. I really like these cars. These are pretty cool. And the 07 Ford Shelby GT500. A uh, white looks like gray with orange on the hood gray and orange on the side it's got the uh, the new style wheels I really don't know what those what they're calling those right now uh, gray plastic base 
No tempo on the, on the rear at all. Nothing on the roof, just the, the hood. And uh, nothing on the front. Yet another Mustang, the 69 Ford Mustang, done up in Hot Wheels colors. It's got the uh, silver faster than ever's on it, what I like to call them. Some guys call them the uh, MC5 or something, I don't know, but I call them the silver faster than ever. It's got uh, white stripes on the hood, and of course the Hot Wheel logo on the side. Chrome base, uh, nothing on the, on the rear, and uh, just the chrome in the front. White interior with a blue tinted window. Chevy Camaro concept in yellow enamel. Uh, chrome five are uh, faster than ever's. Black plastic base. Nothing on the rear and nothing on the front. Looks like a clear window with black interior. Got logo, uh, Hot Wheel logo on the back and uh, the red marker lights. The 71 Dodge Charger in fuchsia or maybe uh, I wouldn't say panther pink. It looks like panther pink here on the on the video, but uh, in, act in all actuality, it, it looks more more uh, fuchsia, more red and, and, and pink put together. Uh, chrome rear bumper, chrome front bumper, black plastic base, and five spoke. Now I've been told that in New Jersey that some of the guys were finding these with the uh, silver faster than ever wheels, so keep an eye out for those. A very, very cool, funny looking, or funny, funny car looking, uh, the Dixie Challenger. This car, I've always liked the body style of this. This is a really, really nice car. Uh, we got chrome front end, we got chrome base, chrome rear bumper, we have tampo on the trunk lid, tampo on the hood, and it looks like a tinted window with a black interior and five spoke of course. The tail dragger here it is in looks like a pearl green with some white and green flames. And this is a Gene Winfield design. I, I had a chance to talk with Gene Winfield at the Syracuse Nationals last summer and uh, he explained to me that that he had designed this car so of course I had to go out there and get one and have him autograph it. Real cool guy, real great customizer, down to earth guy. Here it is with chrome base. Uh, it's got BBS's on it. Nothing on the trunk lid. Got some flames on the hood. Clear window with a looks like a light yellow interior. So very cool piece. And the Dana car. The Danica Patrick ride. Red enamel, yellow flames, got uh, gold chrome on it. It's got the uh, the open five spokes as they, they're being called. Uh, I just call them the black faster than ever's with a with a gold um, trim ring on it. It's black plastic base. Uh, it is a pretty cool car though. I like it. Here is the fast fish in uh, candy apple blue. It's got clear window, chrome interior, no temples on the back, and it's got chrome and black on the front, black plastic base, and it's got the, jeez, uh, I don't know what kind of wheels those are. Man, they keep coming out with all kinds of new wheels. I'm gonna have to look into these wheels. Sixty-nine GTO Judge in a green metallic. 
it's got the spoiler same color five spoke it's got yellow and green tampos on the side says the judge and of course the stripes black plastic base I don't see any tampos on the rear and it's got black grills and all small five spokes all the way around Ferrari 458 Italia it's in a I don't know is that silver or is that more of a a gray metallic maybe pretty heavy flake on it too it's got a clear window with a black interior it's got uh, gold faster than ever wheels black plastic base it's got looks like they're open uh, there's black plastic back in there in the bottom scoops and there's a tempo or not a tempo a, a casting must be the exhaust casting right there below the license plate yep There it is, 64 Pontiac GTO Treasure Hunt. It's got a metal base, look at that. And nothing on there on the back, nothing on the trunk lid. It's got flames, orange and yellow flames on the roof, orange and yellow flames on the hood, orange and yellow flames on the side with the Hot Wheel logo. It's got... Uh, it's got the silver faster than ever wheels, but it's closed behind there. It's not open. So uh, maybe we'll find a difference in those wheels too. Very cool. Nice looking car. One of my all-time favorites, the Plymouth Duster Thruster. Here it's in uh, purple. And uh, it's a lot darker than it looks on the, on the video. It's got uh, white tampos on it. Now I heard that there is either a silver or a white Hot Wheel logo on the side. I have only seen the white so far. This is what you're looking at is the is the white one. Um, this is all tampoed up in the back. You got um, the brake lights. You got the spoiler um, between the brake lights. Supercharged engine, tinted window, white interior, five spokes, chrome base. Uh, I love this car. They did a great job on this car. Here is the Danica Patrick 2010 Chevy Impala. Now, I guess Danica is going to be driving this car. I don't know what series it's going to be. But it's got Hot Wheels on the front which is really cool with the flames um, flame tampo on the side number seven and it's got that new style wheel that we talked about a minute ago um, with a yellow ring around it black plastic base and nothing on the rear and nothing on the front um, good luck Danica with this car 68 Chevy Nova it's uh, satin green, black interior, smoked window, very dark. Um, the base is a charcoal gray. So the rear bumpers, front bumpers and grill are all charcoal. This is that new wheel with a chrome ring around it. Um, I used to drive a car like this. I had a couple of them actually. They were a lot of fun. Cool little car. Here's another stock car. This is the Circle Tracker. Done in... Man, that looks like, like teal to me. With a red tinted window and a gray interior. Uh, gray base. Plastic base. Nothing on the back but a black plastic spoiler. And... Uh, there's that new wheel again with a chrome, red chrome ring around it. This is the Tread Air. This is a really funny looking thing. Um, white plastic base, little tiny wheels in there. Um, gray plastic, looks like wings maybe. 
and uh, black plastic top. Now they finally did it. It's the Back to the Future DeLorean. It's got all of the stuff in there from the movie. Uh, blue tinted window. Looks like gray interior. Uh, ten spoke. And of course all of the tampo just like the car in the movie. Black plastic base. Everything on the back. I really can't see if it says Back to the Future on the plate or not. Uh, it's got DeLorean tampo on the bumper. Uh, there's the DMC on the run on the front. I'm thinking run DMC when I see DMC. So uh, I like this. I, I'm, I like that they finally did it as the uh, the Back to the Future car. And you can see up on the top too of the card it says Back to the Future, and I think that is really really cool. Uh, there are a whole bunch of these out there, so. Uh, I just hope they don't end up being peg warmers. I hope everybody that liked the movie will at least pick pick up one of these. Here's another one of my all-time favorites. You know, I really like the 71 Ever. Uh, I like how they've been doing all the different colors of it. It's got a really nice cool stripe on it. Reminds me of the boss. I don't remember I'm trying to think if the grabber um, had that stripe or not. The I think they had the 302 car that might have had that. I actually took my road test in a green enamel six-cylinder car that my, my girlfriend at the time, her mom, had it, and she let me take it for my road test. And that was somewhere, my goodness, the car was brand new, probably 1975, 74, somewhere around there. I like that car. Here we go. The... 2010 BMW M3. Now all the ones that I saw at the Kmart day, they had a hard time with this tampo for some reason. Everybody kept looking for a car that had the good tampo in the right position. There must be a problem with, with getting all of this lined up. Um, this one I found, it was luckily, it was good. Everything was lined up. Some of them had the, the tampo way up on the on the, the top of the bumper. This isn't a bad looking car. It's got Y5s on it. It's uh, got a tampo on the back. It's got a gray plastic base and uh, clear window with a gray interior. Not a bad looking car. Here's the Mad Props. Black, white wings on it. It says Speed Trapper. Uh, probably trying to make it look like a uh, a radar plane for the police department. Uh, red plastic prop, red chrome, super small five spokes, and another Mustang which we noticed at the Kmart day today. This is the 2010 Ford Shelby GT500 Super Snake. All right. Candy apple red, clear window, uh, black interior, black plastic base, um, ten spokes. And I see the the color of this one, and look at the color of that one. Look how much darker it is. That's a color swing. We've been talking about color swings for a little over a year now, and they've been doing a lot of them. Um, this one showed up. There were a handful of each at our Kmart day and of course anybody who uh, is collecting variations definitely made sure that they got both of these colors. Well and that's what I found at our Kmart day. We had a wonderful time. I hope everybody else had a good time at their Kmart day. I got a chance to see some old friends and of course make some new ones like I always do. I want to thank Mattel and I want to thank Kmart for continuing to do these events. Uh, they're, they're a great time and um, Keep, keep them coming. So thank you very much for stopping by and checking out Hot Wheels Dreams. And we hope to see you on the next episode real soon. Take care and happy hunting.